الخطوط البسيطة والذكية التي تتوخى بيتا مستقلا وحيويا في تفاعله مع المحيط تبرز في البيت الدائري الأشبه بواحة متجددة أما ماركوس أكايابا المعماري البرازيلي لم يكن يعرف أن البيت الذي صممه لأنسبائه سيصبح بيته ومع ذلك صممه كما يحب أن يعيش وفي هذا البيت نتعلم الدقة والأناقة المعاصرتين إن في شكله أو في ديكوره الداخلي أما الهوية التقليدية بكل تفاصيلها فتبرز قوية في هذا المعمار المكسيكي أن تحصل على الخصوصية في منطقة سكنية وأن تركز جل اهتمامك على أن تخدم الهندسة رفاهية الداخل هذا يعني أن تعطي ظهرك للخارج ويتحول الداخل إلى جزيرة منفصلة عن المحيط بها The most important experience of this house is not the form. is the fact that um, we achieve a real oasis. An oasis is somewhere that you always see the water. كان الخيار الدائري ليحضن البيت الضوء دون أن تحرم أي غرفة منه وكي لا يحرم الساكن من مساحة للنظر جاء المسبح ليشكل العنصر الرئيس الذي تتمحور حوله هندسة البيت. So we achieve that that everywhere you walk around, you live around, you always have a, the point of reference of user water. So you disappear from the environment, from the surrounding, you know, a busy road, a, a busy neighborhood, not with the great views, not with that. So immediately you uplifted that property to something else. orange color because psychologically orange is a welcoming color so it's like the big one from a, from a distance so it's like you're welcoming you and when you are in the house it disappears خارج البيت يبدو اقرب الى منشاه صناعيه ومع الاقتراب من الباب الرئيسي يقدم البيت نفسه بشكل مغاير وبمجرد الدخول يعكس أسلوبا ذكيا في كيفية التناغم مع البيئة The furniture, I had a, a trust in the client I mean he had a taste and, and they keep it like that and I mean this is a seven year old house and you see they still keep it in this minimalist way because The empty spaces give you the sense and the psychology of the use, usable areas. So by, by not uh, packed your house like tra the traditional houses with wallpapers and everything. You look concrete as it's a primary brutal uh, material that exposes the nature of the power of architecture. Here we are in the heart of the house, let's put it this way. Here is like, you can see the, the pool, it's hidden behind everything, it's very private. And at the same time, we can see all these big windows here, the, the design in such a sense that everywhere you stand, 
you have this focus of the, of the water. Then the other challenge of looking at it is how you make the openings. So we, we, de we designed that with um, the marine plywood, the opening, so it's like holes and it's like punch-ups in the, in the hole. When you can see from outside that it's not straight, all the windows, it's, it's like a game, it's like a movement. Look, this house. I didn't visit the house for three, four years, and now I, I visit it again. It's so amazing again the experience of looking at it again. Because sometimes when you look in a project all the time, you don't feel it. And I came here and I'm so happy, you know, and it's so good. بعد الفاصل بونويتشي كاتاسي في تين فريسكو دي جوفنتود اه ما coisa muito livre né the master suite is about 3000 square feet The house is decorated in traditional Mexican style. شرشف من كونكريت ألقي على واجهتين زجاجيتين فتكون بيت وسط الطبيعة في ضواحي ساو باولو قريبا وبعيدا من زحمة المدينة الشهيرة بوانويتشي كاتاسي في مي نومي ماركو زاكايابا يوسو مكتيرتو برزيليرو يتو رسبندو بوسيز اكي Hoje no meu escritório, no centro da cidade de São Paulo. E o programa deles, de necessidades, era um programa relativamente simples. Quatro dormitórios, uma sala, né? cozinha, banheiros, etc., o que P fazia, esse programa deles, dava para resolver mais ou menos com 450 metros quadrados. É, o fundamental desse desenho, que é essa casca curva né, de cobertura, apoiada só nas quatro pontas, uma coisa muito leve, você faz com concreto, um vão livre e grande, no caso, tem 25 metros para fora do terreno. Ainda a maneira de ensiabia que se bunia a la acessa o beit, fe sabainiyat, nectashifu kudurati Marcos Akayaba al-Mamari, a la dictasaba shuhratan wahtiraman. Tem frescor de juventude, é uma coisa muito livre, né? muito aberta. Isso tudo, eu tinha só 28 anos quando eu comecei esse projeto, né, em 72. A obra começou em 73. A rica e a insiabia que se encontra em um lugar de 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 um lugar.
com essa casca curva né, sobre esse terreno trabalhado, eu teria condição, como, tem, como existe, né, de fazer um espaço interno completamente aberto. البناء على مستويين وجمعهما ذلك الغطاء فأعطى صالة الاستقبال رحابة وارتفاعا وامتدادا من الخضرة والماء أما غرف النوم فحصلت على خصوصية وامتداد خارجي وجاردي. Ele, de fato, ficou um espetáculo, e cada vez mais, porque agora é um jardim que tem 40 anos, quase 40 anos. Algumas árvores já vieram com uma certa idade, aquelas palme grandes palmeiras altas, verticais. Essas são seis palmeiras dessas. O وانسجم مع قطع مفروشات منطقات لذا لا نستطيع أن نفصل تصميم الشكل عن الديكور الداخلي للبيت حيث يتمسكان ليشكلا شخصية البيت الفريدة تين صفا تين دو لادو دو ما لاريرا نو شيميني اي دو ما استانتي فرانيبو ستاندين كونكريب موتو بي ايس يون فولومي كي كوازي كي اين سي ميزم ايري اون فانيتر ايري فوندامنتال بوركي a sala, por exemplo, é toda de vidro. Não tivesse esse volume com o sofá, com a lareira e esse, essa estante de livros, ia ficar um verdadeiro aquário. E fiz o desenho, né? imaginava fazendo o desenho da casa, em frequentar essa casa como convidado, né? frequentar muito, né? constantemente, como se fosse um clube. تدرج اللون الكريمي ليصل إلى حدود لون الكراميل يبرز خطوطا واضحة وأنيقة. The home was originally designed by Paul Williams, one of the most world-renowned architects. The current owner purchased the home four years ago, started construction on the home. It was originally 9,500 square feet, and it has become today 25,000 square feet. One thing that's really, really unique about the home is that all of the, the, the living areas have very expansive exterior balconies throughout. So you, you find a lot of light coming in the home. Um, you, you get a lot of uh, great flow because of the fact that the architect Paul Williams was famous and was really good at what he did. The living room has the central table that uh, you find an olive tree, a beautiful olive tree, that's growing up into this Art Deco chandelier, giving it that Hollywood glamorous feel. هذه الخطوط استخدمت لتبرز شخصية دقيقة ومحددة تجمع بين الفخامة والراحة داخل بيت يشبه خارجه داخله باعتمادهما هوية واحدة. The dining room is gorgeous. The dining room has these coved ceilings with gold leaf painted details with hand carved woodwork, detailed woodwork that gives it a really nice glamorous feel. 
It's formal and yet relaxed and comfortable. شخصية واحدة في التصميم الداخلي تجمع كل مرافق البيت أشبه بشخصية الفنادق الفخمة من ناحية الدقة والترتيب وبطبيعة الحال في اللمسة الإبداعية a very cozy fireplace with a private sitting area, two television sets, one that was built inside of a custom uh, cabinet that opens up so it's a little bit closer to your bed since it's such a large master bedroom. In her master bathroom, the floors are heated. The bathroom offers a beautiful steam shower with gorgeous views of the gardens. This is a very large estate. Down a long private gated driveway on almost nearly two acres, it has 11 bedrooms and 17 bathrooms. There are 25,000 square feet. It has also uh, a, an attached guest house that has three bedrooms and three bathrooms. There are room for 30 cars on property. pool is the original Paul Williams design pool. It was restored, it was integrated with a state-of-the-art pool cover. It's cleaned by salt water. هنا المطبخ جوهرة البيت بل الواحة التي جمعت أسباب الراحة في مساحة متصلة منفصلة. What can I say? This kitchen has everything a woman would want. It is a very large kitchen. It has a beautiful central fireplace with a warm and sunny breakfast nook overlooking the tennis court. I am Mia Trudeau and it was a pleasure having you. Thank you for visiting. بعد الفاصل Hello Qatar TV. Uh, my name is Wesley Gleason and I'm coming to you from San Miguel de Allende, Mexico. Yeah, the house is decorated in traditional Mexican style. Hello, Qatar TV. Uh, my name is Wesley Gleason, and I'm coming to you from San Miguel de Allende, Mexico, and Casa Carino. As you look at the house, there's a beautiful um, t a double staircase going up to the main level of the house, um, and also down to the pool, which makes it really um, dramatic for people to come to and from the pool area. The style of the house is traditional Spanish um, with some European influence. You'll see through the house a lot of columns and arches, um, domes, and other traditional European touches. الطراز التقليدي في العمارة المكسيكية يرخي بهيبته على الناظر. 
هيبة تخفف من قوتها الجنائن والمساحات المائية um, The house was finished in 2002 It took several years to build um, It was built using traditional craftsmanship and so has a really timeless look It's aged beautifully and it looks like it's been here for hundreds of years البيت ليس جزءا من الماضي كما يوحي إنه بناء حديث نسبيا ولكن روح الماضي تظهر في ثقافة البناء وأسلوب الهندسة واللون الترابي There are six guest bedrooms in the house um, and each of them is totally unique actually each guest bedroom has a name um, Downstairs, there are three guest bedrooms, and each of them has a unique bed, for instance. One has a wrought iron bed, another a hand-carved wood bed, another an even a different kind of wrought iron bed. Upstairs is the same, with the two guest bedrooms on the, on the main level, um, and upstairs with the other bedrooms um, is the same. Each bedroom is totally unique, but all bedrooms face the courtyard, the pool, and the valley. صحيح أن لغرف النوم تميزها إلا أن الغرفة الرئيسية برحابتها وارتفاع سقفها والخدمات المرافقة لها تتحول إلى جناح بمفردها. The next level, the third level, is the main living area. It has um, a beautiful kitchen. Yeah, the kitchen is a really great combination of a, a very functional kitchen, great for entertaining. Um, but it's also comfortable, so it has seating for everyone. It can um, make food for large groups of people. It is traditional Mexican style in that it has a large hood, large range, and has details such as hand-painted tile, um, great seating areas. It has a fireplace. Very comfortable, but also very functional for entertaining. It has also a formal living room, which is beautiful. It overlooks um, the town. The living room has a balcony with an outdoor living room, an outdoor dining room, a separate fireplace. It also has a dining room, which is will seat 20 people and overlooks the town um, and sunsets. يتجذر الأسلوب المكسيكي في تصميم الداخل وتظهر التأثيرات الثقافية في رسوم الجدران والأسقف ويتناسل الضوء من الطابق الأول حتى الأخير عبر قبة توزع الطاقة إلى كل الأقسام كل غرفة حظيت بإطلالة على المدينة القديمة وحظيت بمفروشات من رحم الثقافة المحلية إن في غرف الجلوس الرحبة أو في غرفة الطعام ذات الجاذبية اللامحدودة والبساطة الجاذبة yeah, The house is decorated in traditional Mexican style and the owner chose art very carefully um, using traditional religious and cultural pieces Casa Carina is a very unique house. It um, combines kind of traditional architecture, traditional style, and also has a sense of grandeur and space that is rare in today's world. I think it's great for entertaining. It has these amazing dramatic spaces, but also is cozy. Like the living room is very um, cozy and comfortable, and yet you could have a party for 300 people, and everyone has space to enjoy themselves. Um, It has details that are kind of timeless with the hand-carved stone, the hand-painted tile, the frescoes, um, and yet it's full of all the modern conveniences, including 